installing the screen protect screen protector on the radio on this 21 Camaro SS1 LE. This will work on all of them, but in my case, this is the eight inch radio right there. So let's go ahead and get to it. So we've got the container right here. I did opt for the insurance, which gives me two kits inside here. And that means I can mess it up and also have one left over. There is insulation instructions right there, which will bring you to this page right here, which will give you good insulation instructions. But I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and let's check out the contents. Application bottle. We do have soap in there already. I believe is what I read in the instructions. You just add water, swoosh it around. What else do we have in here? We have a nice towel. Obviously, we're going to want to keep everything super clean inside. Here's our squeegee. That is a very nice towel. And what else we got? We've got the two kits inside here because, like I said, I did buy the insurance. All right, so we always want to clean first. So I'm just going to use some Chemical Guys No Nonsense Cleaner here. I'm going to clean this up real nice. Critical to have everything off. Anything you leave underneath is going to show up potentially. I'm assuming that's my experience with anything like phone protectors or anything like that. So you want to do everything you can. All right, so what I have is the spray, and I did just add water to it. It already had soap in there. Swoosh it around. All right, so as we peel off, you want to spray it. It's just soap and water, so you really can't hurt anything. It does say spray both sides, even the camera, like I just did. You want to spray your surface and uh, get it directed correctly, set into place, and now we can form it. Like so. I'm wrapping the towel around the squeegee. I didn't show the squeegee. Let me go ahead and do that. So here's the squeegee. You could just go right on it. We're gonna go ahead and wrap it right there. And we wanna get this in place. Start from the center outward, slightly pressing. So now we can still move it. I sprayed a lot on there. And just work it out. Let me see if this helps. Oh yeah, that helps with the seeing the bubbles for sure. Now I'm adding some pressure to it. Really working the water outwards. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave that in place like that. I'm keeping an eye on this corner here. I'm not using the towel because it's hard for me to see. So with this in place. See that little air bubble that I just walked out right there. All the air bubbles should come out, water bubbles. You really want to use the towel to keep from scratching anything. So now I'm going with more pressure. All right, I'm happy with that. That was quick and easy. Here we go with the finished product. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the key on. This has been sitting for about 20 minutes. I'm gonna get it out in some sunlight and uh, let it further cure. And I'm super happy with this. This is super nice. Makes it look like brand new again, all shiny. Buttons still work. So there's no uh, issues with that. I'm even wearing gloves and it's still able to, to pick it up. So that is cool. 
All right, definitely happy with how this came out. Super awesome.